Hi there, and welcome to the channel. So today's video is gonna be just a little bit different. I often get asked how I keep my Jeep so clean. And today I'm gonna to actually talk about one of the products I use to keep my Jeep clean. Cause when I'm not on the trail, I'm sorry, I like my Jeep to be, well, clean, but not too clean. I don't want people to think it's a mall crawler. So if you wanna find out how I clean my tires and give it this wonderful flat not mall crawlery look, stick around and find out what I use. Typically, tire cleaners like this are what people use to clean their tires. The problem with foam tire cleaners is they're sticky, slimy, tacky even. And when you're going on a trail that's dusty, it's gonna go all over your freshly sprayed tire. And it's gonna look like a 1950s style white wall. Well, except it won't be white. It'll be brown and it'll look like crap. It's a foregone conclusion that FSRs and trunk roads are gonna be wicked dusty in the summer. Even when you're on the trails, your big fat tires are gonna kick up a lot of dust. No matter how badass your rig is, all of your off-road buddies are gonna know you sprayed your tires right before the run. And they're gonna laugh at you and call you a weenie behind your back. So while I was up at Marble Mountain, I tested a new product. A product I've never tried before, but I just kind of on a whim decided to see if it would work. It's the no-nonsense invisible super cleaner from the Chemical Boys. This isn't marketed as a tire cleaner per se. It's, it's really just a detergent. But, you know, when sprayed on the tire, it gives it this wonderful, flat, I'm not a mall crawler look to it. And it stays this way, even out on the trail. The dust won't stick to the sidewalls. So this stuff, awesome. Just like the foam cleaners, the first step is to spray a nice thick layer onto your tires. Don't cheap out here, use a lot. Don't forget to spray the inside of the tire too. Let it sit for two minutes or so, and then wipe it off with a microfiber towel. It takes a little bit more effort, I guess, than, than like the, the no touch tire cleaners, because this, as you can see, requires a little bit of touching, but at the end of the day, it stays nice and black. And when you're on the trail, the dust won't stick to the, to the rubber so you don't look like a dork. Your tires will still get dirty and caked with mud and other surface elements, but it will look natural. Your tires won't be loser magnets and get you made fun of like a traditional cleaner will. I hope you liked this video. I was gonna release an adventure video today, but I'm not sure if you can tell, but my voice is just a little bit off because uh, I'm just recovering from a cold. But next Friday, there's going to be a new adventure video. So come back to the channel and check it out. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you like this video, give me a like and maybe send me a comment or two. Let me know how the channel is doing. And in the meantime, I'll see you all on the trail. And there won't be any dust on my tires. I'm out of here.